Let's get you up to speed on this afternoon's market action as we get ready to wrap up the month of January here for the markets. And it certainly has been a strong month. On an intraday basis, we're looking at gains of just around 210 points for the Dow over the last month. We're looking at gains of just over 2% here. The S&P is still well here to the upside. Over the past month, we're looking at gains of over 5.5%, up just about 1% today. But the NASDAQ has certainly been the outperformer over the last several Several weeks we're looking at gains of just over 10% for the month. The NASDAQ 100 also leading the way today, as we certainly have seen. There's a bit of a reversal in terms of what investors, what traders are favoring here this year, certainly betting on some of those beaten down names that we saw certainly get hammered during the month or during the year of 2022. Taking a look at some of the trending names here, a big day for earnings. GM, McDonald's, uh, just some of the names here reporting earnings. Taking a look at General Motors on an intraday basis, we're looking at gains of just about 7% strong results there. Spotify popping about 12.5%. We'll dig into that in just a little bit. ExxonMobil, another uh, strong report here from that company ahead of the bell, up just nearly 2% on the day. Record profits from Exxon following in the footsteps of a Chevron last week. Taking a look at that sector action on an intraday basis, mostly green on the screen. You're looking at consumer discretionary leading the way up just about 2%. Materials, real estate, not too far behind. The laggard in today's action has certainly been utilities. I mentioned some of those earnings reports. Let's take a look at more broadly speaking, the energy sector, a bit of a mixed picture, but Exxon certainly the winner today of nearly 2%. Chevron, on the other hand, one of the underperformers inside the Dow. You're looking at Chevron off just about a tenth of a percent, Dave. And the White House taking aim at both of them today, Shauna. We'll get into that a little bit later on. Thank you.